What's up, y'all? Live from Maui. It is going down in a beautiful major way. Make sure you go to PrestonSmiles.com because I got some beautiful stuff there. So today's transmission. Do what you have to do, not what society is pressuring you to do. Inevitably, I do a lot of podcast interviews and they always ask me the same question, which is, why do you do what you do? And my answer is the same every single time. I do it because I have to. I do it because I must, because it bleeds out of me. And a part of loving louder, a part of being hashtag love's voice representing is doing what's written, what's handwritten on your soul. Doing what you must do, doing what you have to do. Now that means no matter how obscure, no matter how weird, no matter how ridiculous you think this thing is, that's the thing that will make room for you. And we've seen this powerfully with many people on the planet, Steve Jobs being one. He was so convicted, he was so bat crap crazy about creating something that never existed that he was fired from his own company, but he stayed true to the vision and the vision made room for him. Martin Luther King has a quote that says, the universe is able to make a way out of no way. Now I truly and wholeheartedly with my entire being understand this. When you get convinced and get convicted about what it is you came here to give, whether it's video games, horse riding, rock climbing, whatever it is, when you get convicted about it, the universe will make a way out of no way. A part of being love's voice is amplifying and stepping out of the confines of what is secure for you, what society has built for you. We all grew up in a society that said, you should grow up and be a doctor or a lawyer or whatever those things are. Right? A part of being love's voice is doing what you have to do. Mother Teresa walked the streets of Calcutta looking for people to serve because she had to. Nelson Mandela sat in a prison for 27 years because he had to. Oprah Winfrey endured no after no after no after no because she had to. She had to give her gift away. There is a song in you and the chorus and the lyrics and the hook and the melody, all of that will reveal itself when you get out of your own way and start giving from your passion. We're in Hawaii right now and we just drove past the cemetery and I, I couldn't help but be reminded of how many businesses that were never formed there. How many ideas still lay in that cemetery? How many beautiful things that would have furthered humanity still lay there because people were afraid. This is your chance, your opportunity. We live in a lifetime where you can have anything you want. Whoa, anything. So don't you dare, don't you dare die with your dance, with your music, with your song still in you. Do what you must do. Do what you have to do. Woo! I love you guys so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. If you're new to the family, if you've never experienced the hashtag Love's Voice family, the tribe, love and louder, if you've never experienced any of that, click subscribe if you're on YouTube, if you're on Facebook, or anything, share this message. We gotta get stuff like this out everywhere we can. I love you guys so much. Blessings and blessings from Maui, Hawaii. It's going down in a beautiful, major way. Ooh, ooh. The journey home to the self starts and ends with understanding that you are the author of the script that you're living. That the world you view outside is the world that's happening inside. And it's all a reflection 